Hey guys, Vader here. Welcome back to another video. Today we got a special treat for you. Uh, I tested this team out here and uh, we're going to be showing off the girl Milam because we got the exclusive rules here where uh, increases attack related stats by all heroes participating in battle by 5% for 2 turns before a skill is used and then decreases HP related stats by 10% for 2 turns after a skill is uh, used. So, what do we got? We got Ludo, uh, best boy here, my favorite unit. Uh, his path passive is going to be decreasing. Oh, hold on, let me change his association real quick. Um, so that he can uh, better out CC the opponents. So uh, his passive is going to be decreasing the enemy's uh, defense related set. And then Mono is also going to be applying a debuff that's going to be doing something very similar. Basically, the whole team is setting up to make Melon pop off, do a ton of damage. We're going to one-shot basically every unit, turn one, or not every unit, but we're going to one-shot a unit, turn one, pretty much guaranteed. Um, the only downside to this team, especially with this rule, is um, after the first turn, we're not very tanky. We're kind of squishy, so we, we might just lose Melon does insane damage playing one of the best dps units in the game but she is very very squishy so the only downside here is we're going to be very squishy and our cc is kind of low i mean it's it's low for me um i'm not used to having my cc being down this low um the unknown team also is also kind of low but that's okay we're gonna go ahead and get right into it Alright, so we got Estrosa Zeldris. Turn 1, we do out CC. Ludo out CC, CC's everyone, that's good. So, I'm pretty sure that Estrosa is dead. Yeah, the Estrosa is dead. Um, hopefully he doesn't have evade food. But, um, yeah. In insane damage. And mono with the cleanup. Now, my mono cosmetics are not as built as they could be. So that's also hurting us. Um, but I did get my Melon cosmetics maxed out. She is only 3-6, I believe. Um, mono is 3-6 as well. Yeah, see. Uh, Melon is not tanking anything. But she did survive that. Uh, well, she's dead now, and we have a ton of Ludo cards in hand. Alright. Hmm. I think our best course of action here is just to go with the Ludo ultimate. Um. I mean. It's not going to do the most damage, but. Oh, he can also just take away the ult the ultimate. He might not. Ah, oh, that's unfortunate. Yeah, see, after turn one, even though we kill turn one, um, after the first turn, there's really not much we can do. I'm pretty sure we lost this. I mean, I highly doubt Mono's killing here. Without the Ludo passive, we're, we're kind of doomed. Yeah, that just wasn't enough damage. Oh, we got another Esterosa. Alright, I'm guessing this guy has dodge food. That's also very unfortunate, but... What's the odds we manage to kill here. I mean, if he doesn't have evade food, I'm pretty sure he's dead. Yeah, that's what I thought. Although, Melon popping off a little bit. Ah, so close. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we lost this one as well. Go ahead, go ahead, get your get your darkness stacks off. 
Now, unfortunately, Milim is disabled. Um, let's hope that, uh, you know what, hang on. Alright, Estrosa should 100% be dead now. We have a ton of debuffs, and Melum's basically dead. One AoE and she's gone. And we have... Once we lose her, we have a ton... Well... I mean, we will merge one of the Ludo cards. Oh, he's gonna have double ultimate. Oh, bye bye. My whole team. Okay, well, it's not the demon team, which kind of destroys us. Um, hmm, how do I want to go about this? So, Sariel is going to be a big issue for us here. But I'm thinking that Tarmiel. No, let's go after Gother. And then we'll do that. Oh, easy. 161. It's beautiful damage there. Estrosa in the back, okay. So definitely an interesting team. So if he stances, then, uh, which he definitely is, we're not going to be able to get the mono debuff on him. Alright. I think... Alright, so here's what I'm thinking. Full send on the damage. We're not going to do that card. We're going to do the single target. Um, see if this is able to kill. Oh, Mono did like no damage there. That's unfortunate. Yeah, that wasn't very much damage either. this one oh no not the goddess team so a big, big issue I have with running teams like this where, uh, you know, the team is set up to do insane damage early on is because typically those teams don't aren't good in the long run. They're not going to last. Um, although, we're doing some really, really good damage here. Um... Unless you're facing another team that's also kind of set up in a similar way, you're, you're going to fail. So t take that from this, I've lost every match in this video so far. Um, and when I was testing this team out before, I, I was also losing a lot of the matches. It's, it's really cool to see those big turn one numbers and everything. Uh, just in the long run, it's not worth it. Okay. So Liz healed up quite a bit. 
here's what I'm thinking. We're probably gonna lose Melum here, but this should kill Sariel at least. Oh yeah, easy, okay. Oh, actually Melum will live. 100k, type disadvantage. And we, we life steal a little bit on mono. Oh, Liz is probably going to kill Mono and probably going to heal up quite a bit. Yeah, bye-bye Mono. It's unfortunate. Okay. Melum, I need you to kill, please. Oh, but she is going to disable the uh, ultimate. Um, So that's good. Okay, nice. So we, we, we managed to win one match. So now I'm going to try to get the windscreen with. Please don't disable my ult, please. Let me let me get the windscreen with it. Come on, Zeldris, you know you want to. No! Why would you do that? He just, he just doesn't want me to get the content. Okay. We're going to do this. do this, this, and then this. Alright, nice. Ludo didn't do too much. Nice. Okay, so we have a demon team with, uh, with the blue Zeldris. Is that... Hold on, let me take a look at you real quick. So this is the Ominous Nebula Zeldris. Um, let's just take out that Esterosa. This is going to be the last match, unfortunately. Hopefully, maybe we could possibly get a win here. Merged with Melly. Oh, you have Zeld you have Chandler in the back. What? Okay. So this might be an issue. And he gets ultimate. Okay. Um, I can't disable the ultimate because it's a. Uh, didn't look like he got a stance. He's going after Ludo first, but I'm pretty sure Ludo's the tankiest one on my team. So, uh... Ah, uh, no. Without Ludo's passive, we're, I think we're kind of screwed here. Uh, merge with uh, Melon, please. Uh, okay, that'll work. Okay, okay, come on. Please tell me this kills. That was like no damage. Oh, that was some good damage though. Oh, oh, come on. Ooh, let's go. All right, all right, that was pretty clutch. And we're gonna get the uh, we're gonna get the ult off of Milam. No, no, why would you do that? Why would you do that? We were gonna get the ultimate. <sighs> All right. Well, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and y'all have a wonderful day.